The city of San Jose, capital of Costa Rica, is one of the world's fastest rising tourist destinations. It serves as Costa Rica's cultural epicenter and is home to dozens of art galleries, performance venues, and restaurants that celebrate the country's rich legacy. Join Vucation as we tour through the best things to do in San Jose, Costa Rica. Visit the National Theater of Costa Rica Visiting the National Theater in San Jose is a must for any tourist. It's one of the city's most prestigious landmarks and features beautiful European-style architecture. It opened its doors in 1897 and once served as the primary selling feature to entice wealthy tourists to the city and nation. Visitors can spend their time exploring the theater and learning about the country's history for a small fee. The marble sculptures and other works of art in the foyer will take your breath away. Visit this wonderful symbol of national pride with the assistance of a knowledgeable guide and take advantage of the on-site cafe and souvenir shop after your tour. Spend some time at the Parque Metropolitano La Sabana. In San Jose, this massive park is sometimes referred to as the lungs of the city. It's a nice place for visitors to take a stroll or have a picnic and a popular place for locals to get some exercise and some fresh air. It's in the heart of San Jose, and it's sometimes compared to New York's Central Park. It's a terrific area to people watch on the weekend and take in some green space in the heart of the city, despite the crowds. Spend some time at the Central Market A visit to San Jose Central Market is a must. The energy of traditional marketplaces is refreshing regardless of the time of day. It's entertaining to observe the natives going around their daily lives, and you can also sample regional cuisine and buy unique keepsakes. Since it's one of San Jose's most significant landmarks, most tours of the city make a stop here. There are many stalls, making it an excellent site to buy San Jose souvenirs. If you're looking for a place to eat and you're in the market, Soda Tapia has several options. Make sure you stop at La Sorbetera de Lolo Mora for some of the best ice creams in town. The municipal craft market next to the central market is the best place to pick up some additional mementos. Dozens of local vendors are there to sell their handcrafted goods. Explore Metropolitan Church The Cathedral Metropolitana is a large and beautiful church in the center of San Jose, located immediately next to the National Park. Its interior is far more elaborate than the unassuming facade, with intricate wood carvings, stained glass windows, and a Christ figure from the 17th century. It's a magnificent site for visitors to San Jose, whether or not they are religious. Explore amazing woodwork at Bisan's Woodworks in Escazu, on the slopes of Belo Horizonte, you'll find Bisan's Woodworks, a bit of a hike away, but well worth it if you're looking for a one-of-a-kind souvenir that blends sculpture and gifts. The shop is managed by the well-known craftsman Barry Bisan's, who employs ancient methods in which the natural grain patterns of wood are used to decide the final form of the item. Therefore, you may discover a wide variety of bowls, humidors, and containers in this section. The prices are higher than those of the Mercado Central's trinkets, but the product's outstanding craftsmanship more than makes up for the higher cost. Explore the Serenity at El Valle del Rio Orosi Orosi River Valley is a fantastic area to go if you want to get away from the city for the day. The valley is located within Tampanti National Park, which offers activities like boat rides and whitewater rafting. On your way to the park, you'll drive past plantations and the lovely Costa Rican countryside on your way to Cartago, the country's first capital. Be sure to stop at the oldest church in Costa Rica and relax in the park's natural hot springs while you're there. Be sure to bring your camera. Not only does Oro Sea have some excellent hiking routes, but the view from the peak is breathtaking. Before we tell you more, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to Vucation if you haven't already. Tour San Jose Museums if you're interested in learning about Costa Rica's past, San Jose is home to a number of excellent museums, some of which are world-class. History buffs and art connoisseurs alike must check out the Pre-Columbian Gold Museum. It has one of Latin America's largest collections of gold antiques. It also houses around 1,600 objects, some of which date back thousands of years. A large portion of the contemporary performances is the breathtaking art exhibitions. These exhibitions of art offer a fascinating glimpse into the past, transporting viewers to a breathtaking landscape of the pre-Columbian era. In addition, there are stone and ceramic exhibits in the building's bowels that guests can peruse. Other museums include the Jade Museum, located on the Plaza de Democracia. The museum houses the best collection of jade in the world, with more than 7,000 artifacts and pieces of jade. 
The Children's Museum is another exciting place, particularly for kids. It's housed in what was once a correctional facility and now has interactive exhibits and cultural and scientific demonstrations. The National Museum is one of the museums with historical significance. It's located in a former stronghold and is regarded as a cultural landmark because it was where the army was disbanded in 1948 under the leadership of President José Figueres Ferrer. Lodge in Premium San Jose Hotels Guests of San Jose's finest hotels can look forward to world-class amenities and a variety of exciting activities, creating a vacation experience they won't forget. With 24 alternatives, travelers can discover opulent lodging in San Jose that's both convenient and stylish. You may stay at a hotel near Central Park or the San Jose Cathedral, or you could choose a quieter location and more luxurious site. The Grand Hotel the Grand Hotel is centrally located, making it convenient for visiting the area's many attractions. The hotel is very good and now part of the Hilton brand. Hotel Presidente A high-quality, state-of-the-art, centrally located urban hotel. It welcomes pets and has both traditional rooms and concept rooms, both of which are decorated in a unique and modern style. Holiday Inn Aurora Guests of the Holiday Inn Aurora can enjoy the hotel's on-site restaurant, bar, and spacious indoor pool. Views of San Jose are spectacular from every room, and it's within walking distance of downtown. San Jose Barcelo Barcelo is a lovely resort with a gym, restaurant, outdoor pool, and a racquetball court. Feast at Awesome San Jose Restaurants San Jose is a major city, so naturally there are both foreign and domestic dining options to choose from. The Septimo Sentido Gourmet is a charming eatery in Escazu, serving delicious food created from scratch using fine ingredients. They offer a variety of vegetarian and vegan choices, as well as breakfast foods, sweets, burgers, and coffee. Restaurante Tiquicia This Escasu restaurant in the hills provides a breathtaking panorama of San Jose and the surrounding area. It's hard to believe you're still in the city of San Jose when you look out from this cafe. On Friday nights, local children perform traditional dances and songs, while guests enjoy traditional cuisine and drinks. It's a great spot to take in the city's sights and sample some authentic fare. Other interesting places to eat include Barrio Escalante, which has great restaurants and vibrant nightlife, as well as Posada de las Brujas in Escazu, which provides affordably priced, hearty servings. Take the kids to Museo de los Niños The Children's Museum is conveniently located and has engaging exhibits, making it a top choice among San Jose's cultural attractions. Located on top of a hill in the form of a castle from the Middle Ages, the site is ideal for a family outing because of its picturesque vantage point over the city below. Now it's time to hear it from you. Did we miss any of your favorites in San Jose? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Viewcation if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.